Njoroge na Ulani Mundu Mukaulao na Aite kwa kilungu cha midhenya itano nukuwe chakana na kwa tiwe ni maovisa maavolisi na kufingwa medho wa lawa toigwe kisioni utakisi na kufingi wa nyumba na kutiswa kueka na na mauta alao na umetie ndhi sianza ama kimanzita silingi bilione kumina monza na kueka na na ikwani yelawa dha kiti kotini wa Mombasa haine na kotini wa Mombasa emu amba na wakili wake tilifo mbeta Njoroge ni wenda silikali viki ya kumunenga mauta make haiwe takana ni wate yenzi ya ila askelite kumia mauta aandhi ya ataki liwa chutuma niwe, niwe Angelina Muse Njerinu kwa takana madhina make maambisi itino wa kumia mauta ndhi isi anza vala itino wake kuandiki the statement maufisi ni manene maadisi ya emosi ni wailovi ni wawe takana niyo maafisa ama avolisi maamu kwa ati na kumoto wa kisiyo ni kingi na kumove na siendo ila wae na siyo yevo simu yake So tulianza kutoka kutoka kwenye murango ya CID headquarters Aa, na nikaona tumerekea jia ya kwenda kiambu so nienda nikiwauliza bwana mwanipeleka wapi jamani uh, kabio sijali hakuna shida kabia na hisi shida wakati tulienda kwa muda ndio uh, nikaomba za kuambia tafadhali msini uwe mimi ni mama niko na watoto wananihitaji niko na familia inanihitaji naomba msimwage damu yangu manake Sijakula cha mtu wala sijaiba ila tu nimeleta mafuta na sielewi ya kwamba nimetolewa katika DCIA office uh, na ninaelekezwa mahali penye sijui nuko atakana kavinda nikaona asiitwa maofisa ama volisi ni mana amotesi ama imwenda avikie kuatakana mauta ati make na kana avikie kunanga ne ama kwe serikali wakati tulifika pale niliambiwa sasa tumefika shuka kachukishwa kwenye gari Sijui ni wapi na hata sasa siwezi kuelezea ni wapi. Na bado nimefungwa uso. Hata nyumba siwezi kuambia uh, inakaa vipi. Sijui. Nikaigizwa ndani ya nyumba ikiwa nimeshikiliwa nafuata nyayo mpaka nikaingia kwenye hiyo chumba ambayo iko na mattress tu na chain ya kufungiriwa na nikaambiwa na takikana niseme ukweli na nisidanganye manake nikidanganya hiyo ndio itakuwa mwisho wangu wa kuishi na wala sitaona watoto wangu tena na nikawambia yale nimeandikisha katika DCIA office it is truth na haina uongo wowote na hiyo ndio statement nitafuata baka kesho yake. Nuko atakana kavinda ni kaona asiitunona nenga wale uvala itino kuonekana ate na vitu unavikie kulechwa. Aiwe atakana na alikisio kesio ni kiva kuvi na nyayo msini wa ilovi. Ndio wakati huo um, maybe sijui ni masama ngapi manaka uwezi jua masaa pale ama dadikani saa ngapi. Ndio wafusa wengine walikuja na wakaniuliza maswari ya kwamba niseme ukweli na kama hamna ukweli maisha yangu itaisha hapo. Kwaambia ninaambia ukweli mafuta ni yangu na nimeleta na niuze. Na sina uh, mko na documenti zote na evidence baka ya refinery mko nayo. Malo ya maanjeri ni maweta kananda ili teku nya maswa na niwa ili teutungi wa mauta make na alama kuweta kana nuna asiete nzi ila siya ili teku mavicha vandhi ya Kenya ni kana avikie kumata. Remember we had said that the last time she had been seen she was these officers and we mentioned them by names. They told her she must come and withdraw the case. Not only that she comes and withdraws the case, she can instruct the lawyers to withdraw the case. That is the only way she will leave the airport. Now we are saying here clearly we are not withdrawing the case. We are saying here clearly that we shall not be threatened. We are saying here clearly the case must go on. And we are saying here clearly that impunity must die. There's a lot of impunity that is going on. Mama, what was the reason to pay court orders if these court orders can be, can, uh, are being disobeyed? So what is the reason of court orders? And then, uh, and then today we are being told that the court orders has been discharged and yet, yet, the judge did not address the issue of contempt. 
Where is justice? Where is justice for mama? Sasa wamechukua mafuta lakini sisi kesi bado tutafuatia. Tunataka mafuta yetu. Ana tafuatia mafuta yake. Iwe yako hapa au yako nje au popote, mafuta ni yake. Gilivote ya vilingi wa mauvoku, makauntini ya Mombasa ni itawa Angelina Musee.